featured subs to a special speed paint. You guys asked some great questions, so let's just great get straight into it. Starting with some art related questions. Question number one, what's your favorite art supply? So my favorite art supply is definitely watercolor paint. I just really love working with it and it's just really nice how I can layer the paint and you know have freedom of mixing colors. Question number two, what's your favorite and least favorite drawing you did? So for my favorite, um, I have two. I can't really choose between them. So two more recent art pieces. Um, the one I did with three 3D flowers, which I'll pop up on screen. And um, the ones where I did a page of only using one color for each char character. I love both of those. For least favorite, I'm also going to choose two. So, my first least favorite that I'll say is this one drawing from Inktober. I think the concept was great, but I think the execution was bad because I rushed it. But, you know, everyone doesn't like everything they do. You have good days and bad days, so oh well. And for the second art piece, it's just a very old um, drawing I did that I'll pop up on screen. Question number four, who are your favorite artists? So growing up, I took a lot of ins inspiration from drawing with waffles, N Natalia, Madej, and um, love to draw manga. Now my fav favorite artists are a lot smaller YouTubers that I've become friends with, like T, CCAS, um, Izzy Doodles, and Chelsea. But um, I just love a lot of their art and how you can actually get to talk to them rather than just watching them each day. And um, just, it's nice to have some smaller you YouTubers that you can actually communicate with. Question number five: What artists do you look up to? So I may look up to. Um, there's this, so most, most of these artists are not necessarily look up to them themselves. I just really love their art and want to improve kind of towards their level. But um, I think this artist's name is Rin Spirit Art. She just has very nice watercolor and she uses the brightest colors and there's just lots of de details and it's just very nice. Um, Scott Kristen Sava, he doesn't only do watercolor, he does a lot of artwork, um, but he just teaches a lot of lessons and his artwork is amazing. And then Sia, I'm not going to try to say her last name, but I'll pop her up on screen. Um, I love looking at her videos because she does comics with watercolor paint and she still does them by hand. And I kind of want to do my comics by hand, so it's very inspiring for me. Question number six. What are your art goals for 2024? So for my main art goals, I want to improve at detail work, backgrounds, poses, color comp comp composition, and lighting. And of course, I want to make more professional art videos that I can use to share my art with you guys. I'll, I overall always want to improve my art and learn new things. I'm hoping that in this year I can find at least one thing to learn with each painting to improve. Question number seven. What's your favorite movie? So this was a hard question for me. I actually had to like really think about this. Um, but eventually I decided that my fav favorite movie was Leap. Leap is a movie about two orphans who break out of the orf orf orphanage to pursue their passions. So one of them goes off to be a ball ballerina and the other one becomes an inventor. I think it's a great movie and then you should watch it. <laughs> Question number eight. Do you have any other hobbies besides art? Yes, I do. I, I like to write, write stories. So... Crochet, I like arts and crafts, 
baking and de decorating. When I was younger, I used to do ballet, cheer, and tennis. But I was quite young when I did those, so they, I didn't really do them very seriously, especially ballet. Question number nine. What is your favorite pastry? You know, pastries are very nice. I don't know. But I think that I'd have to say either croissant, cin cin cinnamon roll, or some type of chocolate donut. I can't decide. <laughs> Question number 10. What's your dream pet? So I'm a huge dog person. I love dogs. So my dream pet would be a black, brown, and tan pom Pomeranian. I just think they're so cute and fluffy and they look like little bears. They're just adorable and I love them. Question number 11. What is your dream car? So, for dream car, I don't exactly know what car I want. I just know that I want a blue car. I know that when I'm a bit older, I want to get a big, like, fam, fam, family car that I can fit lots of people in. But I'm not exactly sure exactly what model. I just want it to be blue and comfy and have lots of trunk space. Question number 12. What is your go-to outfit? Honestly... I mainly just wear t-shirt and jeans. If it's cold, t-shirt, jeans, and a jacket or a sweater and jeans. Very simple outfit. <laughs> and the last question, question number 13. Do you want to be a full-time YouTuber? For that, I would say basically yeah. The thing is, is that I want to be full-time in a lot of things basically all my hobbies. One day I want to start a bakery. I'm always trying to open up a crochet business and I would like to continue writing books as I get older. Um, so YouTube can go along with all, all of that because I can vlog it, you know, make, make videos about it. So I feel like I can still be a full-time YouTuber while still doing all those other things full-time. <laughs> But those are all the questions I hope you enjoyed and that I answered your questions um, in a way, I guess, I don't know, <laughs> and that I answered all, all your questions well and that you like this painting I'm doing in the background. Thank, thanks again for 100 subs. Bye guys!